What's up? Welcome to mini review number fuck you. I don't keep count. I'm Shed as always. Pat's there in the background. He doesn't seem to be interested in this. Once again, a trip to the Asian market brings us snacks. Today, corn soup flavored these crunchy triangles. It looks. Sorry, I got minorly attacked by the cat. Uh, they look kind of like bugles, but off, so I'm excited. Because I like the texture of bugles, and I think those are corn snacks. Uh, pardon the crinkles. Oh. Oh, that just straight up smells like corn. Don't you. What? It straight up smells like corn. Do you, are you sure you don't want to try one? Depending on your reaction to it. Okay. We gotta let the cat sniff, as is, as is tradition. Thank you. Yep. I lube out. It tastes like corn. This is corn. Oh. This is a corn snack that's turned back into being corn. Just in case I absolutely hate it. Okay. It tastes like corn. You know those sweet corn chips that I got and loved? It tastes like that. It tastes like corn. It's distressing how corn-like that is. The fuck? Right? Okay, that one... I mean... And that one didn't taste as much like corn. That one didn't have as much of the flavoring on it. I mean, I'm never gonna eat those again. No, but like... Yeah. For what they are... Oh, God. oh, no. Aftertaste? Oh, God, that aftertaste is terrible. Hang on. Look, I've been... Shoveling them down. I'm just sitting that in the chair for a sec to let the aftertaste oh, hit me. That aftertaste is terrible. Ah. Oh. Okay, yeah, now... It's got... Ugh. Kind of a garlicky aftertaste to it. Ah. It's I, strong. I hate that. The corn flavor's good. The corn is really good and it hits you yeah. immediately. And then... Soup. Yeah, no, I... I hate that. It's not bad. It's just corn soup. Yeah, it I'll, is. It, it it gives you what it says on the tin. I just wasn't expecting it to be two stages of corn and then soup. I expected corn soup. Right. I'm getting in here now. Okay. Welcome back. Thanks. Yeah, I'll completely admit that's not bad. I will never eat those again. Though. No. Like ever. Like. I feel like I got what I paid for. I paid three bucks for this. And, like, with import costs and all that, yeah, that makes sense. Yeah. It's good. I like the texture. The texture of these is great. Or, like, uh... You want to know what's weird? The texture kind of reminded me of Rice Chex. A little bit, yeah. Which, um, which is my favorite cereal, Rice Chex. They have this in the, uh, Lay's Popped, I think, or whatever the fuck they are. I don't know. The ones that have the... That are basically this, but, like, hexagonal. God damn it. What? I meant to bring over my Fanta to, for the other thing. Well, you still have time. You don't have to do that just yet. Oh, I know, but I'm looking at them. Mm. If you want to do it in, in the same video, you can. Fuck it, why not? We've done multiple products in the same video before. All right. Let me get, let me get my drink. Actually, yep. no. I've got fucking... Crane grape and crane apple right here. Alright, I was gonna say, decide what you want to do, and then... Which one of these do you want? Do I want? Yeah. Uh... I, I got two with the intent of you eeny, getting one. Eeny, meeny, miny, that. Apple? No. Yeah. I couldn't tell. It looked like you were pointing Well, I was apple. pointing at the grape, but... <laughs> yeah. well, I'll let you try the grape, too, if you want. Yeah, I and mean, I'll go for the grape. Because yeah. I like crane apple. I have never in my life had crane grape. Well, try it real quick. This, yeah. this is a mini review for you. Mini review of Ocean Spray Cran Grape Juice. How many reviews can we cram into one video? With the us? The answer is yes. With us? Yes. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, they mean they say grape and mean it. Oh yeah, they do. It's fucking good. Fair. I love. Also, it. damn. That is my favorite cran drink that they have. Okay. All right. So technically, item number three in this mini review. Yes. Honey butter potato chips by Calby. Yep. I'm gonna assume that's how the name is pronounced. In lieu of any other explanation. Yeah. Uh, they were the same people that did the Takoyaki Balls, and I'm not in Frank. Hang on. Let me scoot back in Frank. They're the ones that did the Takoyaki Balls and the seaweed chips. Two of the seaweed chips that I have. These should be good. It's honey butter. Honey's good. Butter, eh. But butter and potato, I understand, because, like, baked potatoes. Or mashed potatoes. Alright, give here. Let, let me whiff. Well, they have butter. Get some. That's just stressing that I mostly smell butter. My immediate thought upon smelling the bag was movie theater butter popcorn. Fuck yeah. So, but I have high hopes of this, but it's a potato chip. Yeah. I'm trying to get a small one. Yeah. I have no fear. I just grabbed the first one I saw. There. Alright. Oh. 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 Okay. Ooh. Ooh. I had to take a moment to process, which is why there was a slight look of disgust of just... Uh -huh. right, now, I'm going to do what I did with the other one. I'm not going to go for another one, because those are fucking good. I'm going to see what the aftertaste is like. Yes. Because right now, I'm not getting an aftertaste, which is very weird for a potato chip. I always get an aftertaste with a potato chip. No, I'm just getting more potato. Which, with the butter, is just fucking, like, mashed potatoes. Fun fact, your stomach thinks all potatoes are mashed. Fair enough. It's weird. I'm not getting much honey. Just no, I'm not butter. getting honey. It's good. Oh, yeah. It's fucking good. I'm just not getting really any honey. Hmm. All important second chip? All important second chip. First impressions are good. Second is what seals it. Mm, okay, that one had a bit of sweet to it. Yeah. Now, now that I know what I'm looking for, and can filter out butter. I mean, I can't necessarily say I'd go out of my way to buy these again. Yeah, but, like, if for whatever reason someone had them around, I would snack on them. Yeah. They're... Same idea as just plain buttered popcorn. If it's there, I'll have it. It's not if bad. If you like your mashed potatoes with butter in them, then you're gonna like the taste of this. Yeah, that's... It bas it's basically just fucking buttered mashed potatoes is what that tastes like to me. Yeah. And, you know... And it's kind of distressing how they were able to put that flavor exactly in a chip form. Yeah. Like, butter flavor is not hard to replicate. And I guess technically anything's gonna taste like potato, if it's potato. But... <sighs> Which is weird, because, like, barbecue or sour cream and onion potato chips, at least the Lay's variety, don't taste like potato. Fair. You know it's potato. You know it's potato, but you don't... But it doesn't taste potato. like. But it doesn't taste like potato. Yeah. The only one that tastes like potato is classic Lay's. Yeah. So if you like and, mashed and, potatoes, and he, and and even, even the, the cucumber even the Lay's. cucumber Lay's, it didn't taste like potato. It tasted like straight up fucking cucumber. I am still planning on. Me. Oh. Um. Uh, never mind. This is a spoiler for a future video. Yeah, we'll talk about it uh, once we're okay. done recording. But this, these are really good if you are in the mood for, like, a buttery snack. Yeah. If, I you're, if you're in the mood for a buttery snack and you don't have any, like, buttered popcorn on yeah. at the ready. If you're that sort of person that, when hungry, you just make mashed potatoes? Yeah. Ugh. Excuse me. Sorry. Hmm. Okay, so, rating scale. Corn soup. I'd person. Ow! I'm putting bitch. that around a five. It's not bad. I'll give it, it a four. Yeah. Like, it's, I'm not gonna go out of my way to get it again. If it's there, I'll have it. But, more often than not, I'm gonna look to see if there are other options. It's okay. It's fantastic at what it's trying to be. I just. 
don't like what it wanted to be. I disagree with it personally. I give it a four. Yeah. I'm never gonna buy those. Well, I mean, yeah, I'm not buying. I'm like, like six and below is I'm not buying this. Seven up is I'm buying this. Fair. I think I've. I'll probably change how I define my numbers as we find things that rank higher or lower. I, I feel like it kind of depends on on the category that we're doing. Correct. Yeah. Now, Cran... Cran, Cran great. great. I personally give Cran Apple, you never got my review of it because I've had so much of this in my entire life, I give this a 9. I'll give this an 8. I don't know if I'd go full 9. The grape is a lot. And it's not like your standard purple grape. It is grape grape. It oh, is yeah. the fruit, which I should expect is a fruit juice. However, I am so used to so many things that are grape flavored being purple and not the fruit. Prime example, Mountain Dew Purple Thunder ex Circle K exclusive. Yep. It is purple. It's supposed no. to be plum, but it is purple. How long has it been since you had the Cran Apple? Uh, not that long. I had it relatively recently. Okay. Uh, my rating on that, probably the same with you. It's about a nine. Like, like, if I'm getting a fruit juice, I'm getting Cran Apple. Yeah, like, or don't get me wrong. Grape, or Cran White Grape. Fair enough. Like, don't get me wrong. I love grape. Grape is one of my, if not my favorite flavor of all time. But I would even rate, rank the Cran Grape at around, like, a seven or an eight. Yeah. I'd get the Cran Apple over the Cran Grape because that's just a little fucking too powerful. Yeah. And now for item number three, the Honey Butter Potato Chips. Oh, what's your number on that? Depending on the day, because even right now, I'm fluctuating between a 7 and an 8. Yeah, like, that's really good. I appreciate the fuck out of that. If we were allowed decimals, 7.5. Yeah, I'd, I'd agree with a 7.5. But if we have to give it a full number, I can't. Yeah. Because it's going back and forth between 7 and an 8. Depending on my mood, I might give it a 7, I might give it an 8. Yeah. Like, if it's there and I want something buttery, but I don't feel like popcorn, great. If it's there and I just want something for starch, fantastic. It suits your needs. It It's very much in the same line as just basic bitch plain lays. Mm -hmm. Just, if it's there, perfect. It's, it suits your needs for snackage. It's substance. It's substance. It's a snack. It's, there's nothing particularly remarkable about it other than it tastes like butter. Yeah. And... My main, my only complaint with these chips is that it labels it as a honey butter, honey butter, I almost called it honey barbecue, honey butter potato chip. I got no honey. Yeah. Like, there's a like, sweetness it, to it, but it's not honey. Yeah, like, even when I was able to isolate the butter taste out, it wasn't honey. It was sweet, but it wasn't honey. Yeah. Again, perfectly fine, but I don't know. Although I feel like a, labeling something as a sweet butter chip sounds significantly less appealing. Oh, 100%. It sounds Honey like, butter... It sounds as appealing as fucking fried butter. Or deep fried butter. Uh, now, there is a part of me, my inner fat ass, that wants to try deep fried butter. I will never try deep fried butter in my I entire life. I have eaten deep fried Oreos in, before. One day I'm gonna have a deep fried Twinkie. Some fucking day I'm trying deep fried ice cream. Shen, what did the fuck you think of? Furnace Stop turn, that. Furnace just turned on. So, for anyone that's seen UHF, there is a particular concoction that Al's character makes for the character played, I believe? Oh, fuck, I forget the name of the actor. Not the actor. It was an actor and musician. Played his roommate. The Twinkie Wiener Sandwich. Take a Twinkie, flip it upside down, slice in half, hot dog, cheese whiz, or spray cheese. Shen, no. What if we deep fry it? Shen, no. Shen, yes! Shen, you're trying that yourself. Good! Look, the Twinkie Wiener sandwich is apparently very good. I'm fat. I'm not that much of a badass. I am, which is weird. Because I only have, like, this much gun. I can only get, like, oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Enough to pinch where it does hurt you. Yes. As opposed to, like, me. Yeah. 
You got enough gut to grip without hurting yourself. <laughs> I mean, it doesn't feel comfortable, but... <laughs> yeah. Which is weird, because I... I don't work out, but I... <laughs> I don't work out, but I move furniture for a living, and it's and I'm still somehow gaining weight. Yeah. Ah, mech. So yeah, I think that's gonna end this review video here. Yeah, like, not bad. Not bad. Uh, generally, an air of mediocrity, but with a pleasant sense. Have you ever tried this? Yes, I don't like them. Okay. Did you buy these or did I buy them for you? I don't know. Anyways, show the camera. I will give my quick rating. Planter Spicy Cajun. Uh, just as a quick rating, I will give those a five. Again, if they're offered to me, I will eat them. I'm not going out of my way to buy them. They were okay. With your permission, I'll just bring those to work with me tomorrow and pawn them off on a co-worker. Go for it. Like you pawned your... Uh... Oh. Hmm. Last things that we can do that Shen has ex here has experience with. We don't have any to present to you, but the... No, the, the candy bar I chucked at you. Well, that. And okay. I was thinking the um, Hot Ones Pringles that you had pawned off on me. That were my problem that I made Vinny's problem. Right. I want to like them more than I do. They don't taste bad. My problem is they are spicier than I can comfortably handle in the form of a chip. And I've got pretty good spice tolerance. But there's something about being on a Pringle that makes it so much hotter. Don't know why I keep my hand close to the chest. Ooh, low frame rate camera. Ooh, blur. You good? Yeah, I'm okay. Uh, I do think I want to call this relatively soon yeah we're gonna we're gonna be calling in, in a moment yeah right. so yeah Shen, as um, always pedophile a7 well links description yada 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 yeah we'll see i'm fucking tired yeah. we'll see you guys in the next one peace out guys bye